Hello guys, it's me Nick here, welcoming back to Let's Play Pikmin. Last time we explored the Forest of Naval, and today we're gonna continue exploring the Forest of Naval. Uh, we tried to breed up some blue Pikmins, which not too good result, but it it could have been worse actually, so I, I take what I got. Hopefully we'll be able to actually get somewhere today, because last time we only managed to get two parts, which isn't too bad, but it can definitely be a lot better. Uh, what I want to go for is that part over there, and that part over there. Uh, so I want to start with taking out my fire pigments, because we're gonna need them. Uh, I think that's 40 should be enough, Hopefully, otherwise I'll have to go back and grab more, which will eventually be annoying. Hopefully, uh, 40 should be enough. Oh, look at... There, there are just so many enemies. Uh, we want to go down here, if I remember correctly. Yes, we want to. And we want to break down this wall, which shouldn't really be a problem for fire pigments, considering that the fire from the enemies can't hurt them. Uh, so I'm just gonna put them here and hopefully that guy won't blow fire on me. And what do I want to do next? Well, I'm gonna tell you. I think that I want to take some blue pigments and uh, go for that one star. Are you? No, you. Oh, you do actually have. This guy here, right, right in front of me, he has a power. Not power up. He has a ship pot. We want to get our hands on that guy. Which will eventually be a little bit annoying, but it's still manageable. So we're gonna take every blue pigment because 23 isn't that far off from 20. Uh, do I actually have some blue pigments planted, planted here? Uh, I don't... No, I don't have. Uh, sorry if I, like, checked the map a lot. I'm just not really sure... Exactly sure on where I should go. Uh, but it shouldn't really be that much of a problem. I think that I want to throw my... Pigments over here. This shouldn't really be an anim enemy, so... Uh, it should be alright. Uh, and then I can go and get them once my fire pigments are done with breaking down the wall. Uh, I want, I might want to go and take some uh, some yellow pigments. And oh, actually, actually, uh, we want, we might want to try to go for this guy. I'm just gonna take out 30 red pigments in hope that we can get our hands on him. Hello. Uh, all right, we we can't hurt him because uh, we need to have taken an item. Because where? Oh, we can we can actually just kill an enemy. Then we, then he will come to us. So where will we find this enemy? Probably like down here, because there's a lot of enemies. Besides, they can't really kill us because we uh, we have fire pigments. So that's good. Uh, he can still hurt our captain, our captain Olma. Uh, but yeah, if you're careful enough, you can just really survive really easily. It's not really that hard to avoid attacks while being on Olimar. It's sort of like avoiding your pigments getting attacked. Uh, so we just want to carry this guy back to our camp. And then... Then this fellow here... If he actually will, re will react to that. Hello! Sir? Sir? Sir, please, please. 
eh, he's probably not feeling for it today. Uh, but what he's supposed to do is that he's supposed to try to take uh, one of your your stuff that you collect. I'm just gonna like, quickly take all my pigments and kill this guy mainly because it's fun. It's really fun to kill people. No, not really people, but like kill. Oh, it's, it sounds bad either way. It's really kill fun to kill stuff. So the reason why we wanted fire pigments is because of these geysers. You should normally have taken any pigment, but I chose fire pigments because I don't want to worry about stuff. So, we're gonna put them here and we're gonna continue walking on to find our blue pigments, which will collect this thing, or at least they will collect it out of the water. And I forgot to read the instructions. How lovely. Uh, either way, we'll just quickly make sure that it get out, gets out of water. After that, I'll go and collect some red pigments, uh, about 20, and then they'll carry this thing back to camp. Meanwhile, I'm just gonna let these, these blue pigments uh, walk home. Uh, if you want to, you can throw the blue pigments in here, and they'll turn into red pigments, which will be very, very useful. But since I already have like 70 or something, yeah, it's 70 red pigments, it shouldn't really be a problem. Hello. I need a couple more. That's a little bit too much. Couple more is not all right. 20, 21 will do. Twenty one will do. So we're gonna let these pigments carry that treasure back, which will just be lovely. After that, well, I have no idea what we will do. Actually, uh, we might want to go for treasure out here if we can avoid. Oh. Screw that, we, we have unlocked another treasure, which really didn't take too long, actually, now when I think about it, and you need yellow pigments, no, you don't need yellow pigments, you, uh, you need blue pigments, you need blue pigments, or do you? Yeah, you need, you need blue pigments. I actually think that you need like a little bit of both, so I'm just gonna take a couple of red pigments, like... Uh, yeah, 20, 20 will do. I'm gonna go back to camp and I'm gonna exchange, exchange these with yellow pigments, because we might need those as well. Actually, I'm, I'm just quickly gonna test if this will work. And as usual, they can't be hurt by fire, so that's nothing to worry about. Uh, where is that? That, that bug. It is over there. Huh. <sighs> And you guys won't follow me, and not everyone will be- Oh, actually, actually everyone did follow me, which is a little bit odd, but... Eh. Everything is odd once in a while, so it's not really anything to worry about. Either way, we'll put these pigments back, and we'll take out some yeah, yellow pigments. What we'll do with the yellow pigments, I have no idea. Well, actually, I actually do have an idea what to do with them, but I barely have an idea. So, let's go back! <laughs> There's a lot of, like, sidetracking and stuff like that. There's a lot of things you have to repeat. And now comes the most dangerous part, the part I don't like. I actually think that, uh... It... Oh yeah, it's happening! It's happening! 
Over here we have if I can actually find it. Over here we have Ace. Okay, it's not it's it's not happening, it's not happening. I'm I'm just being stupid. That's really awkward. <laughs> Either way, we'll try not to get anyone killed. Uh, if your pigments, for some reason, get burned, you can save them by the same way you do uh, if they drown. You just blow the whistle a couple of times. Uh, it shouldn't really be that hard. I'm just gonna throw my pigments up here, and then, after that, I am going to go after my blue pigments because I need them. At least I think I need them. I'm not really sure on that. We'll have to wait and see. Can I actually get up here? Yeah, I can. And so we're gonna throw you guys down here once again. And it will be lovely. You'll, you'll love it. Because I need your help once again. And do I have to walk around again? Yes, I do. I have wasted my time. So, uh, I guess I have some time over to ask how you guys are. How have you been? Uh, I've been great. I actually I've been a little bit tired lately. Where are you going? <sighs> I've been try tired lately because I don't get enough sleep uh, because of school. Analog computer. This string strengthens the outward emotions of the dolphin's computer. While it does make the computer smart, it also makes makes it quick to ang anger. It's just like my boss. I have now recovered 10 out of 30 parts. If I can find just two more, I should be able to increase my ship's capabilities. Uh, I don't think that we'll be able to find two more parts. Oh, I, I'm just die if I can like get one part, uh, one more part today. We might, uh, if we're lucky enough, we might get a. Uh, a third one, but I highly doubt it. I highly doubt it. I, I think we're just gonna have to go with the parts we get, we've got them now, or seen now, actually. Actually, we, we haven't seen the second part yet. We're about to see it, but we haven't seen it yet. Ooh. Mysterious. Uh, either way, we want the blue pigments to open up this, this geyser, geyser, or whatever it's called. This this stream. And then we can get the yellow pigments to drown! Yes! That is exactly what I wanted you to do. You... I just got... I just gonna let you guys drown. Because you're stupid like that. I found my Libra! My daughter gave this to me. It's named after her. Astrological. After her. Astrono astrological sign. My sweet little girl, I wonder what she's doing right at this moment. Probably nothing. She's probably sleeping, actually. Uh, which is something that I should do more often. Uh, I should probably try to get into that. That conversation once again. Uh, I actually don't get enough sleep because of my school. And that is not cool. Yeah, the, the reason why I don't get enough sleep is because uh, you know, I can't really go to sleep like until she's like uh, midnight. Until she's at me. Oh my god, there's some blue pigments here actually. Oh, that, that, that was close. Anyway, I can't really go to sleep if... Uh, I can't go to sleep unless she's like... Oh, come on. Uh, 
I can't go to sleep unless she's past midnight. Which seems really, really stupid, but that's just simply the truth. Uh, I, I can't really help that. I wish that I could help that, though, because not being able to sleep just feels bad. Uh, we're gonna try to get past these guys over here. Hopefully not getting killed. Hopefully, we can actually... Oh, come on, wait. <sighs> this guy won't work the way, the way I want him to work. That That's okay, I guess. Not everyone wants to work the same way I want to work. Uh, you guys, you guys do have the time. Uh, where is my... Okay, you're there. I'm just gonna wait a little bit. Uh, because I do trust you, actually. Are you gonna interfere? Are you gonna interfere? Okay, I don't, I don't, I don't trust you guys. Oh! Oh, um, no. That's not what he does. <sighs> anyway, that that is today. We collected one piece or one part, and we almost got a second one. wasn't really wasn't really a eventful day, but that's mainly because we had to look to do a lot of stuff to get these pieces. Uh, hopefully, I'll be able to get more pieces lo next visit. I think that we have four pieces left, and I do have an idea on what to do to get those pieces. And we didn't lose any pigments, except for the ones that drowned. Six days since impact. I have seen that, at times, the leaf on top of a pigment's head will grow into a bud, and then a flower. It appears that if I do not pick the pigment sprouts, they gradually bloom over time. Fascinating. This melding of plant and animal traits is, sh is surely unique in the natural world. I have found flower pigment to possess increased swiftness. When in a rush, I've found pre pressing and holding A, then calling the flower pigment forth with the D-pad to be quite an effective strategy. I've also learned that the new sprouts found growing on days with following fierce battle battles are the result of seed being left behind. We sprouted two pigments today! And we lost four in battle, which I didn't even know that we lost four. I only knew about two, which were which were the ones that drowned. Apparently we lost two blue pigments and get and gained a couple of red ones. I'm super confused. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I've been Ismay Nick. I hope that you enjoyed the rest of the content on Skyloft Gaming and we have a lot more than four parts left in this area. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye.